I'm singing a song from you, Judith, singing my life in words from all the difficult conversations you loved. Judith was a writer and poet. Writing is a form of taking something known in your bones and spiriting it into the world. A death is like the reverse. A person of this world gradually becomes spirited into something known only in your bones. She died 10 years ago. We anchor her to us in our writing. The soul keeps wanting to jump into flesh, to become solid, to exist as the world, so real and grounded. But always something is lost, left behind. It's Tuesday late afternoon with hazy clouds and sun through the living room window at apartment number two, Cherry Street. I sat crying as much as eating to take a stab at it. I was wondering again at how we live most of our lives by just staying on the surface. Most of us, most of the time anyway. How can we ever know someone? There are always depths we can't fathom in ourselves, it seems to me. So how can we touch the mystery that is another, even if we're as open and honest as possible with each other? I think you would say, smash the mirror, you are not the reflection. Maybe I would agree. Maybe I would say yes, but mean no. But it would be another difficult conversation and you would still love it. I spent my dreams of you in confidence, in tears. I spend my thoughts of you in constant doubt. What would she say? Who would she be? But doubt has an end, and I know you would love the difficult conversations about smashing me, smashing the mirror. I know this. I will pin you down to this, Judith. Called out to Judith and told her how much I missed her and felt the hole in my life where she was. She was the one person who was never afraid of pain. She brought me here through pain and terror, and only she could look me in the eye in this moment unflinchingly. Stay with me for as long as it took. Judith wrote to me when I was born, my undoing is your beginning, and yes, we are falling in love. I wrote a response 26 years later. I want to touch, I want to feel. Instead I become the alchemy of years undone in an instant. My ragged hedgerows rearrange. It is you waking within me as I once stirred in you. I grasp hold and stumble drunk on those thoughts of love back to the beginning. The mystery of the origin story half told. Where do we go from here? I ask, but there is no answer, only the echo of these old words, because your undoing was my beginning, becoming undone. Why do I write? Where does it go, this writing? Out. It comes home. I write myself home. Here. <laughs>